Hey everybody, it's Lindy Tate from Tater Buggin'. Y'all come on in for another paint party. I'm gonna get everything situated down here. Oh, it popped right up for me. Without me having to click. What? Maybe that's a sign. It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> okay, if you're watching on replay, I would love for you to comment. Let me know you were here. Let us know if you're new so we can welcome you. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, We'd love for you to like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss an upload. We appreciate your support over there, too. Hey, Betty. Hey, Cindy. Hey, Vicki. Um, and if you are watching on replay and don't want to hear all the hellos, you can fast forward right through that right onto the painting. Hey, Melanie. How's everybody doing today? Y'all good? Hey, Opa and Jill. Everybody's getting here. Anybody have any ideas of what we're painting today? Hi, Jerry and Rose. Thanks for tossing the taters, Opa. Hi, Diane. I'm doing good. I hope you are, too. Hey, Susan. I'm glad you caught me live. Hi, Ruth. Thanks, Nori. Hey, Joyce and Linda and Rita. Um, yeah, this is one of my Belle Lilies from last year. And good news, I'm going to have a new code for y'all any minute now. I'm just waiting for it. It'll be back in my link tree. Oh, Betty's got it quiet now. She can relax. Hey, Gail. Hey, there's Trish. Hey, Trish. Rita Ann. Did you see Bobo? Where's that Bobo? Is he walking through? <laughs> hey, Tony and Darlene. Been talking to your mama. Hey, Hope. Good. Becky's here and Cecile. Hey, Margaret. Hi, Debbie and Judy. I, well, I have painted an ostrich before, Joyce. I have. We might have to do another one, though. Hey, Vicki. Hey, Melissa. Hi, Michelle and Cheryl. So, uh, hey, Gwen, did y'all see some the preview of some of the uh, clocks we'll have Sunday at the auction for my, for my aunt and uncle? Um, I'd love to know what you think of them. Hey, Regina and Lynn Ann. Hey, Lori. Opa's on a roll today. Hi, Angie. I'm doing well. I hope you are too. Um, if you have any friends that you know might like something like old watch parts, old watches, old clocks like that, Will you tell them about the auction for me or, you know, share it out on your pages? Um, because I want to get as many people here. I want all the appreciators of things like that. Um, yeah, so I want those all. I want to share it with everybody. And I want to, I want to do good for my aunt and uncle too. So are you Lori? Good. I'm really excited about it. Uh, hi, Jermaine. I am painting another animal today. I just wanted to give y'all a little, little, another little peek. If you're here live, you get another little peek. Hey, Terry. Would you look? That's what we have so far in the way of watches. Can you believe it? So we're, we're going to be working hard this week, getting everything ready and being really organized for this auction. Hi, Judy. Hi, Sharon. I don't know why he's calling me when I'm live. I hope that didn't mess anything up. I didn't put it on do not disturb. Um, but even when you just get um, a watch like this, you know you can take the band off, take the case off, and you have all the little inner workings uh, to use as mixed media. It's up to you what you want to use them for. You can take the inside out. In fact, there's one in here like that. I, I, let me see if I can find it quickly and give you a little sneak peek. Look at that one. Isn't that pretty cool? Um, there's one in here that has had the inside taken out. Here it is. Okay, look, there's a Tweety. There's even a Tweety watch in there. <laughs> These are all going to be up for auction. I'll probably put them in lots, you know, together. But you can take the inside out and you can put a picture in there and wear it just like that. So, ideas, ideas for you. And I mean, hello. <laughs> it's a 
lot and they're filling up another box for us so there's no telling what we'll have by the time Sunday rolls around and um, I'm hoping y'all will enjoy it and see some things that you um, that you can't live without okay so we're gonna paint hey Penny you know who this is can you tell this is a awful awful sketch awful sketch um, I haven't seen any of those yet Melissa but we'll see we'll see I thought I heard thunder I'm sorry oh there's okay y'all hold on just a minute there he is um, I just want to make sure everything's okay he called while I was Hi, I couldn't answer because I'm live. Did you need me? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just nervous because last time I saw him, he was headed next door to my parents' house, and I thought I was sitting here talking, thinking, "What if it? What if it's an emergency?" Um, and he <laughs> said it was a butt owl. So <laughs> it's a llama. It's hard to tell, but it's a llama. We're gonna bring a llama out of this hideous sketch. So let's see, let me, um, boop, boop, boop. there we go. Let's see if we can get everything brought over like this. How's that? How is that? Yes, it's a llama, although it's, <laughs> what an awful sketch, but that's okay. I always say when we, um, when we sketch with chalk, it's just a suggestion. It's not <laughs> written in stone, thankfully. Make some room here. I'm going to get some of my colors out. The colors will be really easy. Um, we're going to do some white, some buttermilk, some gray. Yeah, we're going to put lots of lashes on her. She's going to be the prettiest llama you ever saw, hopefully. <laughs> I hope. I swear that's thunder I'm hearing, y'all. Um, let's see. Let me go for my larger filbert brush. Yeah, see, Opa? Well, we're going to have some. Oh, Terry, you hear it too? So, okay, y'all, Terry's close to me, so. Um... Let me see where I want to start. I'm going to go up here. Yeah, let's start up here. I went to, I told y'all, I went to Hobby Lobby last Friday because I found out I was going to go online and order some more burlap canvases because I didn't have any that were long. This one is 18 by, no, <laughs> eight, not 18, 8 by 16. Um, so I went online to order and I saw that they were 50% off till, you know, through Saturday. It was Friday. So um, I ran up there and they had the exact sizes I need needed and they were 50% um, off. So that was a deal. That was a deal. start. Let me see. We're going to make her fuzzy so we'll go over like this. And what did I miss? Michelle, can you tell? I want to see a giraffe. It was between, Ruth, it was between um, a giraffe and this. So a giraffe may very well be on Thursday. So don't give up on me. Um, her request for my brother-in-law, he and my sister headed to MD Anderson this evening for testing in the morning. His cancer, oh, Michelle, has returned after four years. Oh, Michelle, we will be keeping him in our prayers. Mm, I am so sorry to hear that. So very sorry. Ugh. All right, let's see here. We're going to come on down. Do, do, do. Gonna... It's been a while since I painted a llama. It's been a little while. So 
this is going to be the start of the muzzle kind of area. Let's go on and get some ears going. It will, you know, we'll be painting over a little bit because of the, we got to have a bandana on our animals because that's our whole series, right? Animal series. We're going to do this little ear. Okay, like that. Yeah, she, Cindy's cooking and uh, just absolutely baking in Arizona. It's pretty warm here today, but nothing like that. It was nice this morning, though, when I got up. Got up about 6.45 and went to the porch. And it was a wonderful, like, 70 degrees. Mm. It's now very humid and... 90 with the, the heat index like right at in the upper 90s. Those big old ears. See if we can have her start at least start taking shape here. to be fuzzy. Um, <laughs> did everybody have a good Labor Day? We, uh, we worked. We labored. Worked on a big um, wholesale order for a local gift shop. Worked on it some more this morning. Rebecca, yes, it's a llama. Uh, Melissa, it is. Tater Talk is on Telegram. You have to, um, you know, you have to go to the Tater Talk Telegram channel to subscribe to that. But it's right on there. And now, you know, like I've done a couple of really impromptu lives recently. Like last night, I hopped on last minute um, on the porch. So, I did not send one out then. Make sure, though, that y'all, even on my business page, I had to do this for Ellie's Attic. Uh, I was not getting notified when she was going live, and I thought, what is going on? I kept missing her. Well, I went to my settings, and it um, a setting had gotten changed, and I had to change it to send me a notification every time she goes live, you know. So, y'all, if you're not getting a Facebook notification, check that. If you're wanting a notification uh, through Telegram, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, Tater Buggin or Tater Talk. Let's see. I'm going to go in with a little of this buttermilk. Regina, no, really? Ugh, what is the deal there? Yeah, I am using one of my filbert brushes right now. I don't want a fuzzy llama here. I don't want a fuzzy llama. Shading. Hey, Carrie. Glad you made it. Home from work. Some more white. Paint my number. Yeah, he does, Rita. We've already picked out the spot for it, too. He's kind of excited about that, too. She looks like this is a little scary right now, but we're going to fix it. Right 
I'm going to come out of here. I think once I start in with the black parts, it's going to really, she's going to really start to pop. Now, wait a minute. M my elderly parents both came down with COVID. Oh, who's, who said that? <laughs> Ruth! Ah, turning into a llama! A fluffy llama! I am so sorry to whoever said that about your parents. I'm so sorry. Hey, Carol. Hey, Joe. Let's see. Okay, uh, I've got the general idea of the head, so I've got to get some of that black filled in to, to, just for my sanity, because that's looking a little scary. Sandra, thank you so much. It has already shipped. They have already shipped my painting um, from my Paint by Numbers. For those of y'all who um, hadn't heard yet, I ordered, well, I have an affiliate code with my Paint by Numbers. That's the name of the company. Bandana Animals. Ah, oh, Betty, I love that. That's who said the hopes of that. <laughs> That's what we're going to call it, Bandana Animals, all one word. Um, anyway, they were having a big Labor Day sale, and a lot of us took advantage of that sale and ordered because it was so good it was free shipping and half off most everything and so i hope those of you who wanted to took advantage of that oh ruth don't you worry about it hey janice yeah it looks like an albino llama uh, which there's not a thing wrong with that i don't want to imply but yeah we're going to put some features on this guy. Thank you, Cindy, for adding that link. Yeah, there it is. It's a, I have enjoyed mine that, that I got for myself last Christmas, and it's going to be finished. If I can get back to painting on it soon, it'll be finished before too, too long. I love painting on these canvases because of the background it gives them, Lori. I, it, it's, there's something about animals on this burlap. Now, this looks really skinny now. I'm going to make that fatter. I'm going to work on that a little bit. I'm just getting some gray. We're going to do a little gray up in here because, you know, i got to play with my shading. And go back into some black. Oh, a sparkly choker, huh? Okay. We might get our stickles out for that, huh? some paint on there, Lindy. Okay. Let's do a little bit right up here. Give it some depth. Okay, are we coming to life a little bit more? I think, I think. Oh, do I have a totally dazzled piece? I think the only pieces I have now are big pieces. I'll have to look. I'll look, though. Okay, let's see about some eyes. I want her to have really sweet 
big llama eyes. But I don't want her to look crazy. Not too, too crazy, Lindy. Old pendant from a necklace. Um, I would have to go look at my necklaces. I'm sure I do. Okay, these are these are just starting. Don't don't worry. We're gonna we're gonna work on her. <laughs> Looks like a Halloween costume. I know. She was freaking me out a little bit. I wanted her head to be tilted, and every time I sketched her, um, wasn't tilted enough. I don't know what my deal is about that. Sometimes I can get it, sometimes I can't. So, she, I guess she just wants to look a certain way. I am not, I am not very good at drawing, in case y'all hadn't noticed that. Okay, and we're gonna, we're gonna detail that up. Don't worry. A watch pendant. Oh my goodness, I, I think I have a couple of those around here, don't I? Let's see if we can do some little nostrils. Y'all, we have um, discovered, what's it called? Junior Bake Off. Oh, what's it called? It's on Netflix. But it's like, it's just like um, the Great British Baking Show. But it's kids. <gasps> oh, those children. Oh, they make me happy. They are so cute. We've been enjoying that so much but I couldn't vote any of them out. I just couldn't do it. Oh, thank you, Carol. Yeah. Oh, speaking of hair, let me tell you, Gwen. Yeah, tomorrow is hair appointment day for Lindy and it's none too soon. Ooh, this mess has gotten long and do we need a touch up? Oh yes, we do. <clears throat> And those little, you know, they, their little British accents, they sound so smart, and they're just adorable. Ugh. So the noses are kind of like a little heart. gonna have some puffy cheekies and do gray but I want a little white in there wanted a little bit lighter they kind of have those two little you know puffs right there. You need my hair appointment, Melissa. <laughs> Girl, you're gonna have to fight me for that one. Ooh, I need it so bad. I thought it was last Wednesday. You remember me telling y'all that? That's how I knew. Woo, Lindy, you are over your limit, girlfriend. Forgetting. I really did. I thought, oh yeah, it's it's this Wednesday, you know, and then I found out no, it's a week later. Ooh. So yeah, that 
I'm going to tell Karen she needs to have her magic wand tomorrow because there she's looking a little there. That's pretty cute. Let's see. Hey, Minnie. Did any of y'all see Brooke from where you found TikTok? I didn't see that. All right, now we're going to get this little mouth going. Here. Hello, sir. Huh? Uh huh? Oh, I'm going to say about this t shirt. Oh, okay. Where? Oh, oh, gotcha. Okay. I'll be back over there. All right. Okay, she's coming around. She's coming around. Um, is it Cheryl? Is that how you pronounce it? That's a beautiful way to spell it. Um, I always have some type. I usually have several pictures that I try to um, look at for reference because I'm not good enough to just pull it right out of my head. There might be photographs. They might be drawings. I just do a, my own composite of several. I find ones that kind of speak to me. So that's what I do. Now I'm going to come in with this zinc. We're going darker down here. And see how it looks. If I don't like it, we'll change it. Oh, that's cute. That's making it look fuzzier. Uh. She's coming around. She's coming around. Okay. Let's see. We're going to do maybe a little bit of lighter white. That's going to delineate those nostrils, maybe. <laughs> and, nope, nope, nope. Oh, Lori, I'm sorry. I hate when the, I don't know why Facebook has been doing a lot of that to us lately. Happens to me when I'm watching other creators, too. Okay, I'm going to, I'll get back in there on that mouth and make it uh, a little more, put a little bit more, what am I trying to say, Lindy? Detail in it in a minute. All right, I want to work on these eyes a little bit. Let me put these in the water. And let's see, I want this one. We'll go in with some lighter so she's she's not looking dead. We want a little white right in here. I think. I think I'm gonna take it down here. Thank you, thank you. Get a little bit darker here now that I've gotten her the white. Um, I think, let's see. Wipe a little bit black off and let's put just a little white right in here. Kind of coming around. Mm 
I'm going to fuzzy up her head, too. Let's fuzzy up her head a little bit more. I love it when the eyes start, you know, that coming to life. That makes me happy. That's when I get excited, you know. That's my favorite. All right, we're going to bring this out fuzzier. Because I want her to be a really fuzzy llama. I want to delineate some of those lashes down there. Oh, thanks, Opa. Yeah, that's when you add that little bit of white, it, that, that reflection, it's what truly, I think, brings them to life. It's so much fun. And I gotta watch my tone now today because I'm, I think, I'm pretty sure, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't I see that Ellie's Attic will be on at 5.15 today? Oh, thank you, Marjorie. Y'all are so sweet to me. Thank you so much. I'm glad y'all enjoy this because I sure have fun painting with y'all. This this has been a fun series. I've been enjoying this so much. Hey, Sue. Oh, uh, <laughs> did you go to the one uh, in Alamo, Tennessee? That's the one we go to. And oh, uh, they are. Yep, yeah, there's something else. I've got lots of llama pictures from them. This is just a smaller filbert brush. So far, all I've used uh, are filbert brushes today. I, t I really like using those on this burlap canvas. I'm just filling her in now. Oh, she's on at six tonight. Well, I got all the time in the world then. <laughs> Yay. All right, let's see. Ooh, this is getting to be one fluffy llama mama. Course I'm gonna cover a lot of this up with her bandana, but that's all right. I'm gonna want some of her fluff to stick out. Okay, now I'm gonna make her fatter in the neck than this. Let's go underneath here with some grays and a little darker, that buttermilk. This will be her chin. Saw some that was looking for pictures and um one of them had with it, what did it say? Um, she's a bad llama mama. I remember that song, Bad Mama Jamma. I wanna, now I wanna do a painting of a llama and do that writing around it. She's a bad mama llama. I think that's cute. Okay, let's go under here with some gray. So y'all saw the next, have you seen what our next event is going to be in the Memphis Bells Creative Circle? We are doing a heavy metal event, which is going to be so much fun. And we all have to incorporate metal into our creations. It'll be a shorter event this time. It won't be as many creators because, you know, sometimes it's... Um, a little overwhelming to have the whole long day. It's Americana. The buttermilk is Americana. 
All right, now I'm gonna get out my big filbert brush. Thank you, Michelle. And let's just really fill in down here. Do I want to make it? We're gonna just go on and make it come way out here. I have one of those. Oh, fun! <laughs> um, it's in the Memphis Bells Creative Circle. If y'all haven't joined, be sure to go over there and all you gotta do is type in Memphis Bells Creative Circle. You'll find it. It's a free group and. Um, It'll be, oh, the, the date of it has even escaped me, Kim. Um, September, somebody, can somebody help me? What date? And, because I, I don't know how I've managed it, but I'm in several events between, you know, between now and, um, and in October. I'm in an Elvis event, October 1st. And they invited me because they heard that, you know, I had some Elvis stories. And uh, so I'll be in that on October 1st in another group. I'll be posting about all of these, y'all. Um, September 24th. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, so. Then there's another one on October 8th. I'm trying to remember if there's a theme on that one or not. Offhand, I can't remember. See, I'm gonna put a little bit of this buttermilk down in here. Oh, good, Kim, we'll get you right in ASAP. I'm just doing this underneath some, you know, I'll put white on top of it, but maybe it'll give it a little depth. Well, Vicki, come on, because Moidel is so excited about it. She's got lots of Elvis stuff. I'm from Memphis, so I don't have a lot of Elvis stuff because he was just a neighbor, basically. But she is going to co-host it with me because she's so excited. You know, she loves her some Elvis. Well, I do too, but hey, Karen. Um, yeah, she was excited when I told her I'd been invited. She said, oh, you've got to do it. We could do that together. Okay, we're on it. Yes, thank you, Barbara. It is on the 24th, starting at 2 p.m. Central. I'll be on at 5 that day. Ellie's Attic is kicking us off. I think it's just going to be a whole lot of fun. How's she looking? How, how are we doing here? We're doing okay. Oh, my mom and dad loved Elvis. I, I mean, I, I love Elvis. That's probably the prettiest man God ever created. Um, Aside from Mr. T, of course. So, I grew up, you know, with two Elvis-loving parents, so you can imagine. But, you know, we lived in the Graceland subdivision right next door to him. So, it was truly, he was just like a neighbor. Oh, is Elvis in town? Yeah, I saw he was in town. The gates are open or, you know, whatever. We could ride right up, you know to the front of Graceland anytime we wanted to, or anytime the gates were open. You know, I got the stories about Mr. T, you know, sitting on his lap while his daddy jammed with him, so, yeah. Let's go in and get a little bit more of this gray. Blend that a little bit. How's that looking? Well, Sam Elliott, too. You know, love me some Sam Elliott. Love me some Tom Selleck. 
I don't even mind, you know, the burlap showing through. It just makes her look fuzzier to me. Oh, is Francis here? Hey, my friend from Vine and Silk Designs. I'm so happy you're here. Oh, thanks, Vicki. I'm glad you don't get sick of, sick of hearing those. That's, yeah. It's pretty cool. The Grace, I went to Graceland Elementary in first grade. Okay, let me stare at her. Oh, something about her eyes is making me crazy. I think this eye needs a little detail. Oh, his gospel music. Oh, I know it. That man could sing. Oh, Pam, welcome. I'm so happy you're here. Hope you'll enjoy what we do and hang out with us more. So there's something that needs to be, I'll just do, bear with me a minute. I'm going to figure this out. Okay, let's go over here and some white. Let's see. I'm studying on it. Yes, that's not. Hmm. What is it? What is it? What is it? Okay, let me do this. I have to look up into my laptop um, to see what I do and don't like about her. So, it's something I was just having a little issue with. Uh, so we're going to work it out though. I go back and forth. Yeah, well, um, Betty, I, say, I hear you. I'm gonna, she's gonna get her Dollar Tree eyelashes. So, those are coming. Now, I want to detail this mouth just a little bit more now. Diane, thank you so much for the stars. You're so sweet. Welcome, Tina. I'm so happy you're here. I hope you'll enjoy what we have to offer here and give us a follow or a like or whatever. And I think I want to kind of just a little bit outline right in here. Just, just a little bit. These ladies are so sweet, Pam. You, they are just the best of the best, I'm telling you. great group. I am blessed to know these ladies. Okay, 
what color, let's do this. Let's put a bandana on her. What color bandana should she have? Hey, Rula. It looks squeezable. Yeah, she's so fluffy. <laughs> oh, Judy, I just, you know, I think it's way more the other way around. I am the one who is so blessed to have you sweet ladies in my life. I really do. I'm not, I think they need to be further apart. That. Purple. Orange. Purple. Purple. Only got to see the invitation. Here in Alabama, so I'm really to live next to. Oh. That's so great. Turquoise. Light green. Teal. Ooh, I love teal. Uh, I gotta quit messing with her. Gosh, they all, let me, behind me. I've got a purple and a red and two teals behind me. So, somebody said pink. Oh, lime green. <gasps> lime green sounds fun. Let's try that. We grab some greens here of the lime sort. <clears throat> Excuse me, a little bit of this other one that I like to use with it. And we'll see what we can do with the. Let's see. Leopard. Listen at you, Carol. Oh. Okay. Oh, pulled out two sour, sour apples. Okay, these are the two. Sour Apple and Hauser Light Green. I'm gonna try those for this bandana. Let's see if I can do it. Now, I do not have a reference photo for this on a llama, so I am totally winging this one. Mm. A little bit of this darker. Okay, now let's just jump in and go for it. little blue birds. Oh, and the cardinals. Oh my goodness, the birds are just flocking to the bird feeders right now. I just looked up and saw tons of pretty birds. Look at them. They're so pretty. One, two, three blue birds right there. Huh. Sorry, I easily distracted by birds. Let's do the little knot right up in here somewhere. Let's go in with a little bit darker green right in here to shade. Let's do it really does pop, doesn't it? It's bright and fun. <laughs> Compete with that black. Let's put that on thick right there. And oh, I need a little more white. So 
it doesn't look so, so flat. Have a little dimension, maybe. All right, and Now I want to do this other side. Diane, these more stars, thank you. Let's make that, let's see, how did I do it? I came up and around and around here. I'm gonna make it flop. Down here. some darker underneath here. Oh my. Thank you, Wanda. What about instead of spots doing an occasional little white stripe? goodness that's tough for me I'm di really liking the uh, polka dots and I thought she needed her little fancy polka dots now what do y'all think okay let's get some white up in here so we can tell what's going on with this bandana I, oh, I think I need a little bit darker green is grass green. I think that's going to give it a better something something or other. This one hadn't even been open yet. That's kind of what I was thinking too, Cindy. You know, it just kind of brings it, it's what they're all wearing is little polka dot bandanas. Uh, that's kind of my thought. Ish, I don't know that that's the green to use either. Uh, no, I don't think so. Oh, y'all. Let me see. Where's another? Like, what dark green is going to work? And you can't ever tell. I can't ever tell how well they're going to play together, the two colors, until I try it. I really want to be able to see that shadow underneath. Let's, I think this is jewel green. Hey, Patty, how are you? Yeah, I should just do that. Just add the some black into it. Oh, I'm just trying to be all fancy. Okay, let me wipe that off. And maybe, maybe, maybe I'll just do, do um, my darker gray. kind of cute, huh? What do y'all think? Do a little blending. And what I'll probably do is outline, give it a little outline so we can really tail. Huh. Okay. Let me, let me hit, that. that's a lot of paint right there. Let me hit it with this uh, heat tool and we're going to see where we are. And you know what I want to do? I 
let me get the right size. And get all that black out of there. Let me do this. Because I want her to have the fluff coming out the top. Ah, thank you, Luann. I want her to be a cutie patootie. Okay, let's see. Oh, thank you for those hearts. See, I even froze up on my own page. I'm watching it on my laptop and it's frozen. I'm going to have to go out and come back in on my own video. Do you, Kim? Ah, oh, that's great. All right, now let's give it, let me uh, give it a little detail with some black on this really little brush. Hey, Denise. That's all right. Cindy, thank you so much for those stars. That's so sweet of you. Okay, I'm just going to get a little bit of black on here, and we're going to just kind of give it an outline. Okay, that's driving me crazy. Let me see if I can refresh. Go out. Come back in. There we go. Maybe, maybe, maybe. It'll be good now. Oh, Linda, that's so sweet. Thank you. Yes, Angie, definitely polka dots on the scarf. And y'all, I was gonna wear, somebody suggested that I wear a bandana. I should wear a bandana when I paint these. And I can't find my bandana. I didn't have time to go to Hobby Lobby and get one today, so. Would have been a good day to have a bandana, I'll tell you, covering up this crazy hair. Oh, thank you, Francis. You like it? I'm, I'm digging the, the lime green. Good suggestion. Gives it a little definition. Um... Well, I already, yeah, I already had animals with purple and teal on, so um, I thought, yeah, we need a different color this time. They all need to have a different color bandana on, I think, for the series. What do y'all think? All right, let's do some polka dots. Oh, I don't want to use this brush. That one's not making me happy. Uh, let's use this brush. This is a flat that brush. I love it when we... Yeah, all the others have polka dots, Melissa. So we're going to do polka dots. In keeping with the series, bandana animals. <laughs> I love that. I 
Y'all know we've still got to put her eyelashes on her. Make her so beautiful. Judy, thank you so much. I, I, I could paint every single day. I, I used to. Every day. Every single day. Still want to. sloth with an orange bandana. I have a sloth on my list. I do. I know a lot of y'all have, have mentioned a sloth. Had a request for a koala the other day. I have never painted a koala. I have painted sloths before. Never a koala, so, you know, that's probably going to have to happen. A tree frog with a bandana. Oh my gosh. Um, I'll put some thought to that. Maybe I can get brave and do a tree frog. I don't know. I've done frogs before. I don't know that I've ever done a tree frog. How's that look? So, um, let's do this. Let's do this. I, I hear what you're saying. Who said that about the, um, let's, here's what I'm going to do. Let me work on this, this eye. Is that right, Janice? Uh, I have another friend who just absolutely loves sloths. She's a big sloth lover, too. We're going to take that off, then. And we are going to go in here. Let's see if that looks better. And we're going to go... And, no, Vicki, but we were talking at the beginning. I, that's, I think that's next on my list, is the giraffe. I was in Hobby Lobby the other day, and um, they had some cute animal paintings. So, I want to take bits and pieces. Well, I got, you know, I just took some pictures, because I'm going to add it to the other giraffes that I've saved that I think I might want to do. And, um, so, yeah, maybe a giraffe on, on Thursday. Now, let me tell y'all, Lori, Lori's gone now. Now, this is all that I have left of my Dollar Tree eyelashes, but I think she needs these. She needs lots of lashes. So, I'm just going to cut this in half, and, um, we're going to put this on. Lori was so afraid I was going to super glue my fingers that she sent me a set of tweezers look how cute so look I can use these to cut my little lashes thank you for sprinkling Jerry thank you Patricia okay let's just cut these I've got to go to Dollar Tree now and get me some more eyelashes before Thursday. Let's see. Oh, she is fancy. What do y'all think? Let me move that up just a little bit. Is that right? Can y'all see those? Oh, Melissa, really? Do you? Oh, well, I love them. I'll be using them. She is a diva. Look at her lashes. Okay, now let's see. Which pair of these fancy, fancy tweezers? I think I'll use these right here. Find my super glue that's somewhere on this wreck of a table because I have been working, working. Um, okay, let me tell who, who, is, who said that. Uh, Kim, I have a giraffe paint class that's available in my online shop. I have a lot of paint classes. Um, I wish I had longer lashes too. 
I wish I had those, you know, those real big fuzzy ones. And you know what? If I, um, if I can find some really outlandish ones at Dollar Tree, she'll, oh, can't, get your glasses, Lindy. Um, I will definitely get them for her and we will fix her up with some much longer lashes. Oh, you think so, Linda? Oh, I'm so glad y'all like her. I, this again, I was nervous because y'all saw that sketch. Woo, it was not a good sketch. But I you know, I've painted a lot of llamas before. So I thought surely I can make this work. Just a little bit. So, yeah, if I can find some more of these, I'll definitely. Um, oh, Cindy's, you got that fast, girl. <laughs> Whoops. Come here. Come here. I'm so awkward with fake eyelashes. I could never wear them. I never get them on my face right. Oh, thank you, Regina. Yeah, I've got to glitter those polka dots. I sure do. Come on. I'm awkward with tweezers, too, y'all. I'm just awkward. <laughs> Come on, Lindy make this happen. We got to get on with the diamond dust. Y'all, why, oh, why isn't she sticking? I hadn't had this much trouble. Of course, I didn't use this much. <sighs> Just about to get hot glue. Okay, I'm not going to touch her. I'm not going to touch her. We're going to say that's good. And see if it'll stick. the lady going to use fake eyelashes and arguing with her daughter. Yes, I did see that. I follow them on TikTok. They are so funny. Uh, hey, mama, what? <laughs> and it got stuck. It was so funny. Okay, diamond dust. That's what's next. Let's get the Mod Podge out. I, they kind of did, Melissa. I think it's funny. Because uh, I'm so awkward with it. I, I'll have to use the tweezers for something else. Because that did not help me. Mm. Okay. Just going to get a little Mod Podge on my finger. And dot the... Oof. I don't move. Are y'all stuck now? Maybe. Uh oh, what was TMI? I missed it. I know it wasn't me because I wasn't talking, so I didn't do it. <laughs> All right. A little 
diamond dust. Alright, I'm just gonna kind of tap that in. She's the fanciest llama. Okay, and now I just need to grab one of these paper plates to catch the diamond dust so I can save what I. Oh, look at her sparkle. Oh, <laughs> she said she wet her bridges, huh? Now, can y'all see? Okay, I see I got a little green in her fluff above her, above her um, bandana. Let me fix that real quick. No green in her hair. money shot and call it. I need to add a little more white on the ears. Maybe just a tad. I can't stop. <laughs> okay, so put your paintbrush down, Lindy. Put your paintbrush down. That was scary. Now, get our llama. <laughs> She's pretty cute, huh? Is she okay? What do y'all think? I'm watching. Oh, thank you for the hearts. Thank y'all so much. So let's see, let me show y'all. Let's do something here. I know y'all have seen them, but let's put them all together. So just in case anybody's new, this is our part of our series. So we did a pig and a cow, but they sold at auction. Our hippo, make some room, Wendy. Our chickens, oh, our goat and our let me bring the llama up here come here llama llama do y'all like her what's her name gonna be what a dot if that fell in to the um paint <laughs> can't get them all in one shot do you like the chickens? And they've all got little eyelashes on. Little fake eyelashes. They, these two have attitude. But we've done all of these live. So if you missed any, uh, go back and catch them. They'll be on um, YouTube or here on Facebook. Lily, Lucille, Lucy. Lu I do like Lucy. Liliana. That's beautiful. Thank you, Elizabeth. Lily the llama. Lindy llama. <laughs> oh, I didn't sign her. Thank you, Betty. Yes, I always end up, you know, in with sun in it. Let's a little. So, if you weren't here right at the beginning, we talked about the auction this Sunday. 
of my aunt and uncle's um, clocks and watches and watch parts and goodies. I hope y'all will join me and I hope that you'll tell your friends about it so they can come. She's a little wonky, but so am I, right? It's okay. Oh, thank you, Francis. Loretta Jezebel. <laughs> Lana the Llama with two L's. That's pretty cute. Lindy Lou. <laughs> yeah, it's got to start with two L's, right? Lana the Llama. Oh, thank you, Opa. Okay, I have kept you sweet folks long enough. She does kind of, yeah, she's kind of a Lucy, isn't she? But with two L's, I think. Okay. All right, this was so much fun. Come back on Thursday at 4 for a giraffe. And, um, feather the black paint on the one eye by the eyelash. Okay, I see what you're saying. I'll do that. I will I'll do that while I'm thinking about it. Um, I might do a pop-up live tomorrow. Streak on left, upper. Yeah, I just want it to look like a stray hair sticking out. Lily the Llama. Um... I was saying oh I may do a pop-up live tomorrow afternoon so be watching my page mr. T has um, designed a new wood kit for y'all for the fall you know it's been a while so I want to finish one out And um, I may do that. I may do that live tomorrow. So it'll be a little bonus live. Um, Ellie's Attic at 6. And I'm so sorry I don't know anybody else's schedule off the top of my head. But y'all join me and at, with Ellie at 6. And <laughs> Lindy the Llama. <laughs> I don't know if I can name her Lindy. <laughs> So I gotta go get more eyelashes and love my shelf. Oh, good, Benita. I'm so happy to hear that. I'm really happy to hear that. Y'all, this was fun. Yes, get to see the new wood kit tomorrow afternoon. My appointment for my hair is like at 10 in the morning. So I should be back when, you know, I may be on like at my usual four o'clock. I may come a little earlier at three, but I will let y'all know well in advance and I'll send out a telegram um, and we will finish it out together and I'll go on and get it in the shop. So it'll be ready for y'all in case you want to want to get one for yourself. Uh, <laughs> Melissa the Moose. <laughs> Y'all are so funny. Okay, I'm going to go now. I love y'all to pieces. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I will see you probably tomorrow. Bye.